Hello friends, welcome to a fresh new episode of our channel RG Innovations. If you have not subscribed already, please subscribe to our channel, click on the bell button and select all to get all future notifications of our video uploads. In my previous video, I have discussed about what is a NOR gate, its functions and a demo of a 2 input NOR gate. In today's video, I am not going to discuss much about what is a NOR gate and all. I will only show the demo of a 3 input NOR gate using the IC74LS27. So let us first have a quick look at the truth table of a 3 input NOR gate. This is the symbol of a 3 input NOR gate where A, B, C are inputs and Y is the output and Y equal to A plus B plus C bar. That means Y equal to the inversion of A plus B plus C. Now if we have a look at the truth table, if A, B, C are the inputs and Z is the output, when the input is 0, 0, 0, the output is 1 and in all other input combinations, the output is always 0. Whether a single input is 1 or all the inputs are 1, the output is always 0. Now let us have a look at the pinout diagram of the IC7427. This is the diagram of a 7427 IC. It has 3 triple input NOR gates. NOR gate number 1 is this input 1, 2 and 13. Output is pin number 12. NOR gate 2 is input 3, 4, 5 and output 6. And NOR gate 3 is input 11, 10, 9 and output is 8. Pin number 7 is a ground pin and pin number 14 is the positive supply pin. We will test with the second segment of the NOR gates that is 3, 4, 5 input and pin number 6 output. Now we will have a look at the circuit diagram. This is the IC74LS27. We are using pin number 3, 4 and 5 for input and pin number 6 for output. Input is given via these three switches key A, key B and key C. When these buttons are pressed, the input will be high or 1 and when released, the input will be low or 0. And three LEDs are connected with this A, B, C switches. When the keys are pressed, the corresponding LED will glow that will show the input status. That is when the LEDs glow, the input will be high and when the LEDs does not glow, the input will be low. The output pin number 6 is connected with an LED. This LED will show the output status. When the output will be high, this LED will glow and when the output is low, this LED will not glow. LED is connected via current limiting resistance and these three LEDs are also connected via current limiting resistance and we have used three pull down resistances with the input pins. Because when the input is open or not connected to anything, the output may fluctuate. So we have to ground it with these pull down resistances. This is the circuit. Now let us move on to the practical demo of the 3 input NOR gate. So here we can see the IC which is 7427 or 74HC27 or 74LS27 whatever you can call it. So this IC is a 3 input NOR gate. It has 3 NOR gates inside it. It is a 14 pin IC. This is the notch here and from the left side of the notch this is pin number 1 to pin number 7 and pin number 8 to pin number 14. Pin number 14 is the positive power supply pin. Pin number 7 is the negative power supply pin and we will check only one segment of the IC that is pin number 3, 4, 5 input and 6 output. The second segment of the NOR gates we will check. Now let us move on to the prototype that we have built based on the circuit. I have shown already. So this is the prototype of the circuit and we have used three input switches here. These switches are currently in off position that means the input will be zero and these three LEDs are connected with these three switches. So whenever the input will be high these LEDs will glow and whenever the input is low these LEDs will not glow. And another LED is connected here to show the output status. When the output will be high it will glow and when the output will be low this will not glow. These are the pull down resistances that we have used and we have not put the IC yet on the board. Now we will put on the IC on the board. So we have put the IC on the board. Here you can see pin number 14 is connected to positive power supply. Pin number 7 is connected to negative power supply and a current limiting resistance is used for these three LEDs and another current limiting resistance is used for this LED. Now we will give power supply to this. This will work on 5 volt DC power supply. So we are connecting the positive wire and now connecting the negative wire. As soon as we connected the power, you see this output LED is glowing because all the input are currently low. Now if we match it with the truth table, input A0, input B0, input C0, output is high. So 0, 0, 0 is 1, 0, 0, 1 is 0, 0, 1, 0 is 0, 0, 1, 1 is 0, 1, 0, 0 is 0, 1, 0, 1 is 0, 1, 1, 0 is 0, 1, 1, 1 is 0. So you see when any or all of the inputs are high the output is 0 and when all the inputs are 0 the output is high or 1. So this IC satisfies the truth table of a 
3 input NOR gate. And here we complete the demo of 7427 IC. If you have any confusion regarding this circuit, you can ask in comments. And in our next video, I will show how to create the basic gates from a NOR gate. I will show creating NOT gate, OR gate and AND gate from a NOR gate. So this much for today. Thank you for watching the video till the end. If you like the video, please hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe our channel for more videos. So we will meet again in our next video. Till then, bye bye. Take care. Have a nice time.